Hello, everyone. Welcome to today's morning English. This is Colin. This is Winter. 欢迎大家收听今天的早安英文 So, Winter, I was、uh, watching a reality show the other day,、mm-hmm. and、uh, there was this guy.、Uh, he worked in an office with、uh, it was ten, twelve women in the、mm-hmm. office with him, and he had slept with every single one of them. Oh, 天哪！我也听说了，说是就是看了这个美国的这个情感调节节目啊， yeah. 才发现就是我们国内的这个什么爱情保卫战呐、啊，里面那种狗血的故事啊，其实都弱爆了，<笑><笑>就是各种各样的这个渣男哈、啊，层出不穷。Right, right.、Uh, so let's talk about how to describe these kind of guys. Okay, 我们今天呢就来跟大家聊一聊这种渣男呢、啊，用英文到底应该怎么说。<laughs> Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安英文呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道，每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语听说读写的内容，我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区领取哦。你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当于自动保存啦。So a very common word that I think most Chinese students know is playboy. Right, 这个是大家最熟悉的哈 Playboy. 我们只是复习一下，叫花花公子，对吧？ Yeah. It's also the name of、uh, a magazine. Yeah, yeah, yeah.、Mm-hmm. Playboy magazine. It's an, an old magazine. <laughs> It's from 1953, and it's still going.、Mm-hmm. And it was one of the The first main magazines that was delivered all over America that had pictures of naked women in it. Ah,、uh, 对，这个 magazine 确实是还挺有名的，就是很多女明星其实到现在还会上那个 Playboy. Right, right. And the founder of the magazine, a guy named Hugh Hefner, he lived this very lavish, rich lifestyle, and he would always have. These beautiful women that were trying to get into the magazine because、mm-hmm. it meant a lot of money, living at his mansion house, and and so it was a dream for many many men to live the Playboy lifestyle. Right, to live a Playboy lifestyle. Right, right. 嗯、mm-hmm. ，就是那种整天寻欢作乐的生活方式。因为 Playboy 这个 magazine 啊，它本来就是。花花公子就是那种，呃，倡导这样生活方式的一个杂志。然后刚才 Colin 讲到，他的创始人呢，又是那种盖茨比式的生活，哈。所以大家就用 a Playboy lifestyle 来形容，就是专门这种，啊、呃，到处花钱，然后到处跟不同的女生在一起的这种。That's exactly right. <笑> Now a more modern update to the term Playboy, which is still used, is player. Right, he is a player. 就是他是个玩家，就是他就是玩玩而已。Player. That's right. It's like、um, chasing women is a game, and he is a good player. 对，就好像啊、uh, 追女孩就是个游戏一样。然后 he is a player， 就是他是个玩家，他就在里面玩，对吧 ？Right,、mm. right.、Um, another phrase we use is ladies' man. Ladies' man. 女人堆里的男人，这个意思吗 yeah. Uh-huh. ？Yeah, this is,、uh, you know, he gives a lot of attention and likes to be with women all the time. 嗯哼，就是 ladies man 喜欢混在女人堆里面，混在女人中间的这种男人。Yeah, now remember. 认为自己讨男女人喜欢。Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you, it's hard to be a ladies man if the ladies don't spend time with you. So you have to be successful to be a ladies man. Oh, so you just say a man, even though he likes, is just like chasing women, 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 chasing
Ah,、oh, he was something of a ladies' man. 他在某程度上就是那种喜欢混在女人堆里面，喜欢跟女生呃、哦、弄在一起的那个男生。Right, right,、mm. right. Now we might also call somebody、um, a flirt. Flirt 当名词用。Yeah, he's a he's a real flirt. Flirt. 我们把它当成名词用的时候呢，就是说这个人呢。很会跟别人调情，很会撩的人，很会很会勾搭的人。<笑> yeah, yeah, but it, it doesn't mean that he actually does anything. He, he just he is a teasing kind of thing, and girls are flirts too. 就是撩， yeah. 也可以用来形容女生，就是很会撩，很会来事儿的女生， sure, sure. 也叫 flirt. Um, but sometimes some guys they are compulsive flirts. Oh, he is a compulsive flirt. 这也是口语里面经常用到的一个表达，哈。Yeah. 就是他是那种无法控制自己的，就是很喜欢，天生就是喜欢到处留情，到处撩，到处调情。Can't stop. Flirts with all girls. Right. Compulsive 就是无法控制的，无法控制的到处调情。He is a compulsive flirt. Right. Now. If a man is successful at picking up women, we might call him a lady killer. Lady killer, 师师奶杀手是吗？ <laughs> well, not exactly. He's not he's not murdering or killing anybody, but、uh, it comes from hunting. So you know, you're chasing, you're hunting the girls,、mm. and if you Are successful, you catch them.、Mm -hmm. That means you 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 killed the animal, right? 对，不一定不一定是师奶哈，少女杀手，很多叫什么师奶杀手、少女杀手，啊，叫做 lady killer。就是说，就是你很厉害啊，就把他们一出场就把他们都迷倒了，杀死了 ，kill them, right? Right, right. right. 迷倒了。Now these terms, they're they're not really negative. But there are some negative words to describe how men's attention to women. Womanizer is one of them, right? Yeah,、mm -hmm. that's right.、Um, a womanizer means someone who、uh, he's often just looking for、uh, sh very short-term relationships with women, one after another after another. One night stand. Yeah, yeah, one night stand, that kind of thing. Womanizer, 就是说，呃，是那种玩弄女性的，然后又特别沉溺女色的人。Womanizer, right? 专门玩弄女性，像 one night stand 夜情那种， yes. 每天晚上换不同的女生那种。The Great Gatsby, yeah, yeah, well, it's a very famous.、Uh, he was a gambler, a、yeah. womanizer, and a drunk. Right, 他是个酒鬼、色鬼、呃，赌鬼。Yeah, he was a gambler, 赌鬼。A womanizer, 色鬼,色鬼 and a drunk, 酒鬼 Yep. Now,、uh, another negative word that you should know is philanderer. Philanderer. Yes,、right? philanderer. philanderer.、Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now it means a guy、um, who enjoys having sex with many, many different women, but never ever gets emotionally involved, and also carries the Idea of cheating, like if he's married or already has a girlfriend. Hmm. Flounder 也是一个很很负面的形容哈，就说这个人是一个色鬼，就是专门玩弄女性的，很风流的这种男人，就是到处骗姑娘吧。Yes. 对， yeah, yeah. 就是骗他们，就 sleep with him， 但是从来就是不动情，不用真心的。Yeah. Right. Hmm.、Yeah. Flounder. Well, that's all for today. 是的，我们今天讲了很多种各种不同的渣男的说法。<笑>谢谢大家收听我们今天的节目。Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安英文呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道，每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语听说读写的内容，我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区领取哦。你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当于自动保存啦。Thank you for listening to today's morning English. This is Colin. This is Winter. Thank you for listening. Bye bye. <laughs>